Tonight, a major setback in the fight to slow the spread of COVID-19 in Oregon. We are seeing our highest, highest daily case count yet. That number tonight standing at 484 new cases. The confirmed cases now brings the state's total to 36,116, and this brings the seven-day rolling average to 330 cases. COVID-19 also claimed 11 more lives in Oregon. That raises the state's death toll to 594. Meanwhile, the Oregon Health Authority is now releasing new survey data that shows the attitudes and behaviors of Oregonians toward COVID-19. Our Fox 12's Brenna Kelly explains what we know. There were two surveys conducted, one with about a thousand Oregonians by DHM Research, another by Lara Media, which completed interviews with about 500 people from the Latino community. To judge how Oregonians are responding to the pandemic, two new statewide surveys targeted a range of ages, education levels, ethnicities, party registrations, and areas of the state in which people lived. Here's what they learned. About four in 10 Oregonians are very worried about the COVID-19 situation in the state, but only half as many are very worried about getting sick themselves. The results are much higher on both those questions in the Latino community, and particularly for those aged 18 to 24. I was surprised about the highest percentage of the groups that were worried about COVID was the youngest one. Meanwhile, surveys show half of Oregonians went to four or more social gatherings in the two weeks prior to taking the survey. But researchers were more concerned about Oregonians who said they attended 11 or more of those. People who are engaged in that frequent level of social gatherings are also people who, in the polling results, tended to be people who are skeptical of wearing masks and other and saying physically distant. The data shows attending high number of social gatherings occurred more often outside the Tri-County and Willamette Valley areas and was also higher among conservatives. Oregon Health Authority officials say this data gives them a good baseline for moving forward in their research. We will, similar to this survey, emphasize uh, working with groups representing communities hardest hit by the pandemic. Uh, I think we're also likely to focus on some of the groups that we see, uh, you know, expressing uh, skepticism or about uh, the severity of the virus or reluctance to engage in safe behavior, so probably younger adults. In terms of a COVID-19 vaccine, 5 in 10 people are not sure they would get one. Researchers found 4 in 10 would definitely get a vaccine. They also saw a partisan divide on the issue. However, half of Oregonians haven't yet made up their mind. Reporting in Portland, Brenna Kelly, Fox 12 Oregon.